Cool. The guy over there was just taking a piss, like 10 meters from us. Awesome. <laughs> So this is the Shanti Stupa, it's a Buddhist monastery. You can either ride up the road like I did because I'm lazy, or you can walk up the road, or you can take the 500 and something steps up to the front door. I know which one I, I would take, and I did take. Uh, this is like a little secret access, you got some nice toilets over here, and um, it's a little shortcut up to the top. So the plan for today is to film the Shanti Stupa and go to the internet cafe to upload a YouTube video and then to get a permit to go to So Moriri. Now that lake is where it's all gonna happen. I've heard that that road is actually harder than the Pangong Lake Road. I've heard that So Moriri is even harder. Yeah, So Moriri is a higher altitude. No. But if I do get a permit, then it was, it, do you reckon I'll be able to go by myself? Yeah. Or do you think I'll yeah. die? You, no, no. <laughs> <laughs> you just have to just uh, go, relax, go, relax. Like uh, yeah, go slowly, slowly. right? Slowly. Yeah. Yeah. And then stay there the night. Yeah, yeah. Even though I drove up here, it's pretty damn hard getting up here. You can't avoid the ascent. Right. See where that Buddha is? That's where I'm going. Whoops. I came here yesterday and I did not see that sign. I walked all the way up there with my shoes on. Fine. This is beautiful. Oh yeah. Very nice. We are repairing it after three, three years. Three years. 
You do this for three years? Yeah. Wow, thank you. You're welcome. Good work. Yeah, so a biker earlier was telling me that you can't go to Saul Marui because of some political war going on. So that's a shame because that's one of the dangerous roads that I wanted to go on so I can prove to my 27 or 26 subscribers because I just lost one. You know, my 26 subscribers, I can just, you know, I can let them know how much effort I put in. To these videos. Yeah, I don't think you guys understand. So Moriri Lake. It's about 230 kilometers from here on broken roads that dangle off the side of mountains. I'm going to go alone on a Royal Enfield 500 motorbike, completely vulnerable to the elements. Doing it to prove to myself, you know, to satisfy my ego. I'm still worth something. <laughs> 